you can see something, you know, you know, you expect something from those uh, kids. Uh, I started, you know, like their age, and uh, you never know in future, one of them, you know, become you know, uh, a champion, a champion of the world, a cha I mean, Olympic champion. It is, it is extraordinary, isn't it? And I, I know we saw you at the Great North Run last month, and you put in a, a wonderful performance there. What is it that keeps you going and, and performing at this top level? Because clearly this doesn't happen by accident. It's all about hard work. Yeah, exactly. You know, for me, what is important, you know, just, uh, it's not, only, I mean, it's not a competition. What for me is important is a training. A tra when, when I do my training, you know, just I always, you know, keep, you know, those three important things. Discipline, commitment, and hard work. Without discipline, no commitment. Without commitment, no hard work. That's why I always have to keep those things and then come for competition. It's not that difficult. And some of the films we've been watching that we made with you last month, you talked not only about physical fitness but emotional fitness as well and, and the importance that is to you and, and, and how running brings that to you and could bring that to everyone. Uh, running brings for to me, you know, everything. Uh, I mean, believe it or not, you know, running it brings, you know, for everybody, everything. Uh, people, you know, they have to think about nowadays uh, what running means. They have to have, you know, just like their daily life. Because of you know many reasons, now it's many. I mean, technology it brings good things at the same time, uh, also a disadvantage. What is that? Uh, to keep you know people at office for a whole day, and you see it's uh, too much stress. That's why you know people they have to sweat. They have to go out and run at least uh, 30, 40 minutes a day.